Hello and welcome to this week's Saturday Evening Cocktail. We're making sidecars uh, tonight. Uh, sidecar is another old drink. It will go back to uh, somewhere around World War I. It was invented either in England or in France, and that's actually important as we move forward um, and discuss the drink a little bit more. It's a cognac drink. Now, I don't know much about cognac. I don't drink cognac. Um, so if anybody knows anything about it, wants to tell me about it, you can put it in the comments. I didn't even know which one to buy. Um, this one was on sale, it's Covassier. I figured if it's good enough for the ladies' man, it is good enough for me and good enough for our drinks uh, tonight. So um, what is a sidecar? It is cognac, it is uh, lemon juice, and it is triple sec, and that is really it. So it's it's a simple cocktail. It's, you know, they call almost call it like a brandy-type daiquiri, uh, given sort of the sweet and the sour components to it. Now, the ratio is where I said its location uh, is important. So the, uh, the French school puts the ingredients into three equal parts. The uh, English school um, makes it uh, a little drier. Uh, two parts um, of the cognac to one part and one part to the triple sec and the lemon. Now, the Savoy cocktail book um, changed it up a little bit, kind of works between the two. It's actually a three to two to two ratio. And that's the ratio we're gonna be working off for the first drink we're gonna to do today. So we are gonna start with an ounce and a half of our cognac, our Cavassier, and we are going to put that right into our shaker here. And we are going to use an ounce of the triple sec. And I've got, a sh I've got ice in the other side of the shaker here. So one ounce of that. And we need about an ounce of lemon juice and we're gonna squeeze that fresh so of course as this is a drink with some fruit juice in it we are going to want to shake this and rather vigorously so my three ingredients are in here Pleasant. I've never tried this drink before, so first time for me, maybe the first time for some of you out there. We're going to pour it here and essentially serve it straight up like this. And not a lot of school of thought on garnishing it. Actually, they started sugaring the rim in the 1930s for this drink. I didn't do that. I'm just going to put a cherry into it. And here we have a sidecar, traditionally of the uh, Savoy Cocktail School. Now, it's also fall. End of baseball season, beginning of football season. Let's do a fall cocktail. There is a variation on the sidecar known as a cider sidecar. And for this one, we're going to go use the two to one to one ratio or the, or the English school of the drink. And we're gonna add some um, apple cider as well. And two ounces of that. And back to our cognac. Two ounces of that. And the triple sec. We will need one ounce of that. And for the um, lemon, we'll do one ounce of that. Or again, basically the juice of about half a lemon so it's gonna be a little bit sweeter from the apple cider same thing we're just gonna shake All right. and this one i'm gonna serve in a rocks glass in a red sox fenway park rocks glass because well thank god that's over and for this one, again, not much of a school of thought on garnishing this. Um, I am going to go full fall flavor with this, and we're going to grind a little cinnamon on top and a little nutmeg. And there we have it, a cider sidecar for the fall. Let's start with the original. Cheers. Oh, that's pleasant. Yeah, the lemon really comes through. Um on that triple sec gets hidden and you know the cognac's a star it's got a little bit of a bite uh on the end there and here is the cider sidecar 
Oh, that's very pleasant. That is a nice little drink there. Everything works together. Cheers. I've got some drinks to drink. Be safe out there. Get your flu shots. Take care.